Which day one out of the way, how was it? Good. Um, the, some, some of them young boys are really flying, so it's, it's going to be good. No, I'm really excited to get started and um, um, yeah, it's, it's glad, glad to be here. Is it good to come in on, on day one with those young lads and get yourself better and get to get know the lie of the land? It certainly is. It get me fitness up quick. I mean, um, no, like I can say, I was, I was always a big thing for me. I wanted to come in the first week and that was, um, no, it's good to get started. I've, like I said, I'm the worst person to train on my own. I hate it. I absolutely hate being in the gym on my own, so I'm, and I'm glad to be back around the team again. It's noticeable yourself and Brad were very vocal out there as well. Is, is that something you've taken on personally to really sort of set, get yourself in, in the group early on? No, not, not a conscious effort. I think I'm just a loud person. <laughs> I think that's just the way. No, I think that's just my nature and that's the way I, I've always trained and that's the way I am. But no, I, I, get, I get what you're saying. I think there was a, there's a lot of, um, no, it was good. It was a good drill to do it and it was good. It was nice to get out there. Uh, in terms of how uh, we've spoken previously about how it finished with the million pound game with Catalan, but, but your experience in France is that something you'd recommend to to English players to go over there and experience life over there? A hundred percent would, yeah. I think it was it certainly um, it gets you it gets you to grow up quick. I think it gets you in a, out of your comfort zone and, and gets you in a different environment. I think obviously you can get bogged down of being in the same environment. I, I would highly recommend some of the young the young leads that's going on loan out there and having a good getting a good experience of it because especially now Steve McNamara is in the charge I think it's going to be it's going to be a different prospect and it's going to be a tough challenge going out there. Looking at your your career you obviously had a great start you got England in the England side early on and then you had success at Warrington and the experience at Catalan do you see this is a, a new chapter and potentially the best chapter to come now with Rhinos? Yeah definitely so I think all the tools and the ammunition is there for me to come here that was the biggest draw for me to come here I think that was what I was sold on and I think the, the young talent was the, the big draw for me. I think the like the infrastructure and the young talent that's coming through is, is massive and I think that's going to help help me and help the team massively. Are you having a bit of a chat afterwards there with Barry Eaton, you and the, you and the other half-backs? Is that something that, as a group, you're, you're going to work on? Obviously, Danny and Rob having left the side, there's, there's, there's an element to work on there. Oh, well, there is. I think whenever you go into a new, in, into a new team, you, you need to find the right combination and what works for you. And obviously, we've got two, very, two young full-backs in uh, Ash, uh, Ash Golden and, and Jack Walker, so we're, we're going to need to know what, what positions we need them in and, and how it fits with my game and how I'm working with Jordan as well. And obviously, there's more to come into that. Mooney's got to come into it as well, and there's, there's, there's a whole group of players that have got to come in. So, no, I think it was that was just a, it's just a start. We've just we've been running up and down all day, so I'm, I'm a bit tired. <laughs>